Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. So you're only seeing my hands right now, and um, not my face like usual. So you're going to have to say, you're going to have to be looking at my hands this whole video and say hello to them because you're going to be doing them the whole time. So I'm going to be doing this video, I'm going to be doing something really, really fun I've been wanting to do for quite a while now. And, uh, yeah, so what I'm going to be doing in this video, if you haven't seen the video, the title already, I'm going to be painting slash customizing my very own Uno cards. So I'm sure everyone has played Uno in their life. Uh, it's a very popular board game, I guess. Um... And here is the front, normal front, you know, the original one, and the normal back. At least I think so. Um, so I'm going to be customizing them and painting on them. It's going to be a really fun time. Um, and I, I'm saying that because I've already actually done that. I did it on a character. I painted a character. His name is Jerry, as you can see. And he's a teddy bear my sister gave to me. And actually, my sister got it and she gave it to me. So, he's pretty soft and pretty cool. So, that's what I'm going to be doing with all the other cards. I'm basically going to be painting characters. And for the back, I have, like, this peachy, opaque, like, light, the... Uh, pink with a bunch of s white s's and that the s stand for sierra which is my name <laughs> if you didn't know um and i'm gonna be painting on these characters and uh i really really exciting um so let's just get started so we're gonna move these aside a bye and we are going to bring the board so i use this because um I don't want my table to get painted on, even though it did already, um, because I didn't, I stopped using the board, um, and I, yeah, I basically do that, and right now, what we're gonna be doing is just, a uh, pay take on the white stuff. Hi, Santa, from the future, editing this. <laughs> And that was my sister saying hello. <laughs> um, I just decided to put that in because I don't know. Um, and right here we're painting in the next one with some white paint. And I need to apply that very thickly so I can get a nice coverage. And I don't have to do a double base coat because there's a base coat. So that's not going to be the color I'm going to be doing. But I'm going to... For the characters, I'm going to be using my mermaid, her name is Shelly, and my little bunny. Um, and I showed it, that bunny, in my video of Q&A, my last one. Uh, if you haven't already seen it, go check it out. It was pretty epic. And yeah, so her name, I said that it was going to be Rosie, I think. Or, yeah, um, and I, I said that she didn't have a name, but actually she does. Her name is Lilac, which is, um, the color that she is, she is basically Lilac, which is light, light <laughs> purple. And right now I'm sketching out, um, Lilac, my bunny, uh, in this yellow, light yellow, uh, card I made because I wanted her to make it really soft. Um, so right now I'm mixing... Uh, brown and white and I'm going to be applying that for the shelves and I need to be really careful with the little feet and everything because uh, we have to be careful now with our mermaid Shelly uh, we are just sketching out real nicely what I want her to look like which actually didn't take me that long as I thought um, and right now we are I, right now, I'm out of the frame <laughs> accidentally, but I was making my pink color. I needed to make it lighter and for her tail. And also, I need to put some blue because I, I put, like, what, pink and blue at the same time. And also her hair. Her hair is not very accurate on the color. It was supposed to be more on the purple side, and that was more on the pink side, which is kind of disappointing, uh, but... Oh well, and I used the same color for my bunny, uh, lilac, <laughs> and she actually turned out pretty good, the same color. Now, these are dry, and 
we're going to be making the details with black paint. So I'm going to be doing Shelly's eyeballs <laughs> and uh, her eyelashes. And moving on to Lilac, we're going to be doing her outline, uh, which is really important because I like outlines. It makes it more like put together, I guess. I don't really know. But uh, it was really tedious and very time consuming doing that. Oh no, 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 I hate it. It looks like a mustache. <sighs> yeah, it was very ugly. It did look like a mustache. So what I did was I repainted it with um, the same color I used as the bunny. And that is how it looks. It looks pretty floppy and <laughs> really weird. But I just gave it uh, to wait so I can give it a different coat. A diff another coat right now i'm working on the books which um were gold and white and right now i mix up some like orangey light orange color which turned out really beautiful i really like it and i'm also mixing it white and uh brown and for the books and right now i'm making the books for the bottom shelf which was a mistake because in the future right now i'm doing it in the future but right there when i was painting um, it was a mistake, and you'll see why, so keep on watching, so you know why it was a mistake I did that. Right now, I'm making the pink color for her blush, and right here, I found this purple so I could fix the bunny, um, and I put white on it because it was really dark, and it was turned out really bad. It turned, like, grayish, so that was with waste of paint. Right now, I was painting the bow, and right now, I'm going to be redoing or her, well, right now I'm going to move on with Shelly. And right now I made the outlines with a Sharpie and I thought it was more easier. And it was, but then um, it didn't work out that well, so which was a bad idea. And now I'm making a tan color for her skin. And because, yeah, she needs to be green, not green. And right now, look, I'm putting in, in the board. I'm writing in the board because it wasn't working. It was just really bad. Oh, the camera is shaking. Um, and now my hands are very messy. I don't know why I included that, but yeah. And then right now I'm struggling to do that. And I changed uh, uh, pens, but it didn't work. And I changed it again with this one, which turned out kind of okay. Uh, it was kind of weird, but yeah. And that's how it looked right now. And uh, uh, right now I'm moving on to the back so i have the color i used uh, i think it was like i don't know it was peach i think um and i'm just applying a thick coat so it'll be very opaque and um no nothing of the black will show uh, which that's what i want and now moving on to shelly i have to make her face and <laughs> it was kind of bad but i tried my best <laughs> uh, that's the comparison that I was doing right there. And right now I'm going to be doing her starfish. Because uh, she needs a starfish. And I'm making her outlines once again. Because I covered it with the skin. The paint that was made for her skin. And that's what I was doing with my time. I was letting it do, like dry. So that was great. But okay, that's what I was doing. And now moving, that was dry. I made the outline on her. And this is how it is going. And I'm going to be doing that. Pop. Okay, so I made uh, the, her name, Shelly. took me quite a long time to do it. And I messed up. I put a double E. So that was great. Um, um, and I also put some seashells with this like greenish color thing. And... This is how they are right now. They're already dry, but I accidentally painted in some parts from the back when I was painting the back. I think I forgot to record that, but right now what I'm, I'm doing is I'm just covering those splotches of the paint um, with, with uh, the green, which was the background. I'm just fixing them all up so it will look nice and clean and Brush, and I'm also crossing out that her name because I'm gonna redo it. Um, 
her name so I won't mess up. And I'm also covering up the books. <laughs> this was the mistake I was talking about. Um, and I'm covering it all up because that's where her name was supposed to be. Um, and I totally forgot when I was doing that. So that's what I have to do right now. And I'm doing another coat of green on top of her name because it was really transparent. And so that wasn't what I wanted to do. So I remade her name right now and it turned out fine. And I'm giving an extra coat on the yellow, so it will be nice and that, so it won't be transparent. Now I'm moving on to the S's on the background, uh, just doing all that real quickly. And, uh, yeah, moving on to the another one, to lilac. Um, I found this marker that was white, and I did her name, but... The thing was that it was very transparent, and I just left it like that, which was a horrible mistake. I can't believe I did that, and I tried doing the S's with the marker. It looked very horrible, poorly done, so I just moved with the uh, same old S's with the paint, uh, and it looked a lot better. A long time later, we are here, and we are putting packing tape on it so it'll be secured and all of that will be nice and good so if i accidentally scratch it it will be nice and good because we have the tape and we're doing that again with shelly and remember our little friend jerry yes um we're doing that the same thing okay peeps this is the end this is how it turned out it's actually beautiful um here's shelly up at close and it's really shiny i love that and it's really cool there's the back um the nice shelly and her face up at close and this is lilac very beautiful uh what i don't like about her is that her name is not really clear but yeah, she's really cool, and her face is kind of okay. There's the back, and uh, it's really cool. I really like it. So here's Jerry, uh, our good old friend, the first one, and uh, that's the back, the one that everyone has. Jerry is right there, and here are the two, three, actually, that I did. It was really beautiful. I really liked how it turned out. I hope you liked it too, and if you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and click the notification bell so you'll never miss any of the videos I will post. Love you guys so much. Bye!